Hello folks and welcome back. Let's look at Geography Paper 2 2021 November and we're gonna be looking at question 2 which focuses on economic geography of South Africa and 2.1 there says the photographs below show two types of farming match the description in questions 2.1.1 to 2.1.7 with photographs A or B why don't we need the letter A or B next to the question numbers in the answer book so remember this is essential to follow the instruction as is to avoid being penalized in your final exam so when you look at the two pictures that you are given, we have picture A, remember they say two types of farming. So in geography we have two types of farming, which is subsistence farming and commercial farming. So in definition, subsistence farming is the farming way which includes, um, which includes the production or rather producing for the family uh, with little or no purpose of making money and then commercial farming on the other hand is large-scale produce which includes um, selling of your produce um, to the market or to the local uh, people so with those definitions we can answer the question so 2.1.1 farming that produces a low yield per hectare so that two answer there will be will be a and then 2.1.2 farming that focuses on food security in local communities remember food security is the ability to have access to um, the available food so for the local communities, farming, uh, farming that focuses on food security in local communities, um, that will be subsistence farming. So that will be subsistence farming because uh, subsistence farming only focuses on producing um, the crops for the family. So that can also go to local communities. So our answer there will be will be a for 2.1.2 and then 2.1.3 farming that is capital intensive and uses advanced technology so when you talk about capital intensive we're talking about investing of huge amount of money and use and the use of advanced technology so that will be um, commercial farming because for you to to commercialize your farming you need to put in lots of money um, to buy your tractors and to hire people um, also uh, to buy all the equipment um, which includes your seeds and everything and that costs a lot of money so that will be 2.1.3 will be picture B which is commercial commercial farming and then for 2.1.4 farming associated with monoculture so remember when you talk about monoculture we're talking about planting only single um, type of crops it could be it could be your your sugar cane it could be your um it could be trees that are, are, are all the same but remember we only focus on producing only one type of crops and mainly in south africa could be it will be sugar sugar cane so um this or rather 2.1.4 will be commercial farming remember we produce large amounts of sugar cane to export or rather to rather sell to big markets so 2.1.4 will be will be b and then 2.1.5 farming described as small scale farming remember you only lose 
you, you only use a um, small amount of land to produce um, for subsistence farming so this will be or rather 2.1.5 will be will be a because you only need only small amount of um, land to produce or rather to to crop your or uh, to plant your crops rather and then 2.1.6 it says their products um, for the home and export market remember when you talk about export market you're talking about taking your pro or selling your produce what you have produced um, through your farming to outside markets and that is outside the country so that will be commercial farming because remember with commercial farming we produce large amounts of your crops and then you sell them to outside or rather you export them to to outside the country so this will be picture b which is commercial commercial farming and then last but not least 2.1.7 this is the the farming that is associated with extensive farming practices so when you're talking about extensive talking about using machinery and involving many people um, to to crop and for harvesting so remember for harvesting you would use your machinery and everything and that includes the intensive or rather extensive labor and that includes or rather that will be your commercial your commercial farming and that that was this question it was a very simple question to attempt in the exam which is seven marks one minute per question or rather one minute um is one minute per question which will be um seven minutes meaning one minute per one mark so i hope you grab something from this please don't forget to like share 